everyone, it's Brooke, and today I'm back with another video for you guys. Um, today I just wanted to give you guys a bit of life updates because I haven't done that in a while. The semester is almost to a close. Um, some things have been happening school-wise in my life. Um, there's a lot of updates, and I just kind of wanted to throw them at you guys all at once. Um, so first off, what I talked to you guys about not too long ago was my, the situation with my wrist. Um, so I was going to the wellness office at Conestoga to get physiotherapy done and let me tell you it has done wonders. I am fully functional again at this point. Um, sometimes when I am writing for long periods of time I do still get some swelling but the concept of that is going to go away as I continue to strengthen my wrist. Um, there are various exercises that I am going to be doing and have been doing that have been helping to strengthen that and I have noticed some improvements um, throughout the last couple of weeks. I only have one physiotherapy appointment left and that is just kind of going to be the final wrap-up one. Um, I'm probably not going to do that this week. I will probably do it the end of next week right before my exams happen. Adam, the physiotherapist at Conestoga, did an amazing job at fixing me up. Um, so I am very, very thankful for that and like I said, I am good to go again by exam season. So I am super excited to be fully functional again just in time for summer. Additionally, talking about summer, just a bit of a personal update. Um, I am moving down to Florida this summer. I'm going to be working in Disney World as a character attendant on the Disney Cultural Exchange Program. I've written blog posts about this before, but if you are in a degree program at Conestoga, um, I highly recommend applying for this opportunity. It is amazing and um, I did it last summer. I'm doing it again in the summer. It is amazing. Along with that, um, I was supposed to be doing co-op this summer, which I'm sure some of you are aware of. That co-op term has now been moved to the fall of 20. 20. Yes. So I will be in co-op still the fall of 2019. Then I will be in school back at Conestoga the winter of 2019 or of 2020. Sorry, winter 2020, spring, summer 2020. And then I will be doing my final co-op term in fall 2020. So I will graduate in December 2020. Um, my technical graduation date on my diploma will be um, actually August 2021. However, all my classes and all my co-op and I will be done with school December 2020, if that makes sense. I recently won a scholarship through Conestoga, or actually it was a bursary, sorry. It's the Student Financial Assistance Bursary or something it was called. Um, I won $800, which is super amazing. So I just want to remind you guys again, at the beginning of each semester, the awards application does come out. I really do encourage you to fill that out because you get these bursaries and stuff and um, not a lot of people do take the time to fill it out so there is a lot of money available and not a lot of people applying for it so both semesters this year I won $800 in bursaries each semester which is crazy it has never happened any year before at Conestoga I have won in the past um, collectively I've probably won about $2,500 from Conestoga bursaries, so it is definitely something to look into applying for. Um, I also have people asking me all the time about um, jobs at Conestoga, specifically with CSI and what I'm doing now with Think Conestoga. Um, I have worked for the college. I've only worked for the college for the time I've been at the college. I've done various things throughout the college, um, but I've only worked at the college, and I find that is an amazing experience. So make sure you are checking your Conestoga career portal, the CSI website, checking the posters because there are job fairs that happen, student engagement, I believe they were hiring, I'm not sure if they're still hiring. There are a ton of jobs available on campus, especially right now. They hire right now for September. So make sure that if you would like a job and you're going to be in school in September, you're looking out for those opportunities right now. Um, there are also a ton of events happening right now at the college. Um, so the, I believe it's a Bollywood pub is happening on April 5th that event always sells out so make sure you go on the CSI app to get your tickets on Eventbrite um, or you can also buy them on the service hub please buy them on the app though or on Eventbrite because it makes my life about 10,000% easier additionally it is important to know that the service hub and the food bank and 
maybe the den. Definitely the service center and the food bank are on reduced hours during exam week, so if you have a project due, make sure you're looking at the hours. The food bank will be closed entirely during exam week, um, and the service hub will be open from 8.30 till 4.30, so make sure you are planning your projects accordingly. Normally it's open 7.30 till 7, so there is a big reduction there. So if you have an 8 a.m. Uh, project due and you need to bind a document, make sure you're doing that the night before because the service hub will not be open at 8 a.m. when you need it. Um, in other events at Conestoga, the wellness, it was just wellness week, I think they called it. There was like the food, fresh food market on campus. Um, there was free manicures you could go and get. Um, there was free um, STI testing. There was a whole bunch of stuff that was going on on campus that was totally free and all about supporting Conestoga students' wellness. So there were some great events going on with that. They also had like wellness bingo where you could run a, uh, win a prize. There was a ton of stuff going on with that as well this week. Um, so those were some great events happening at Conestoga. Um, going into exam week, I believe there will be some like uh, exam relief events such as free pizza, pop, that sort of stuff. Uh, the venue also has stuff going on. I believe they just had their like Bacardi event of some sort. Uh, Bacardi did sponsor that. So they had like a big beer pong table laid out um, in the venue, which was super cool. Um, and there is just a lot of stuff going on as the year is starting to wind down. I'm personally getting into my exam season, my final projects are becoming due. It's really, really close to the end. The end is in sight. I can see it. It's almost April. It is almost April. We are almost done. Uh, I believe in you guys. I know you can do this. It has been a tough year, but I personally myself am really looking forward to summer. Um, and I know you guys probably are too. So thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you guys in my next video.